Here's a super easy appetizer for the big game. We're gonna call this the San Francisco treat. First thing we're gonna do, one stick of Kerrygold unsalted butter. Throw that into a pot and turn it on a low temperature. Now we're gonna take some sourdough bread and toss this in the oven. Now let's just extract our meat out of the shell. Oh, and keep in mind, we did not cook these at all. We simply bought them from the store because they're already cooked. We let them thaw out, so we're just extracting the meat. The meat should pull right out for you, and you just pull it right off the tendon, just like that. Now on this little knuckle, you simply just kind of open it up, and the meat should kind of just pop right out of there like that. Now, I like to get in here and get all this fat off of the meat. See that white stuff? Set that to the side. Uh, that's what we want. Now we got our meat extracted. We're gonna get rid of all this fat here. We still got a little bit in there because the fat is the flavor, but I don't like all of it. All right, so you can see as the butter simmers, it kind of cooks some of the fat to the top. So you tilt the pan and skim it right off the top. Now, there's nothing wrong with leaving that in, but today we're taking it out. This is actually called clarifying the butter. Now we just have our clarified butter. Now let's finish this off. So next step, get you a knife, and we're just gonna cut up our crab meat, go back through and do it again. All of our delicious crab meat is diced up. Now you want some capers. I love to use the small ones. We're gonna put about half a jar out, and we're gonna dice those up really fine. Now take our fine diced capers, add those in with the crab. Now it's time for the main ingredient. That's the Dano seasoning. That's the blue top. That's right, I said seasoning. Get it? It's for seafood. Open the top. Oh man, if you haven't had this yet, <laughs> you're gonna need to try it. We're gonna give it a little shake right into our butter. And for everybody that says I use a whole jar every time, well, yeah, doesn't look like I used the whole jar. We're simply just gonna add this right in over the top. Mix it all up together. There you have it. That took me all but about 10 to 15 minutes. Our bread should be ready. Nice and crispy. I take that buttery crab, put it right there, and get you a bite. That is a San Francisco treat. Yum yum, get you some. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like, leave a comment, and as always, keep sprinkling, my friends. We'll see you next time.